Get your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free. List box controls, much like combo box controls, allow you to create a list of choices from which your users can select to fill in a field's value. The choices in the displayed list can come from a table or query, or you can type in your own values. The difference between a combo box and a list box is that the combo box only displays the choices that a user can make once the user clicks the drop-down arrow in the combo box. In a list box, the choices are shown constantly, and whichever choice happens to be highlighted in the list, or selected in the list, is the value that's entered into the field. As such, list boxes tend to take up a bit more space in the form than a combo box. To insert a list box, open the form in Design View. In the Control Toolbox, click the List Box button. Then click and drag over the area within the form where you would like to place the list box. There is a list box wizard associated with adding list boxes that will then launch to assist you in creating the list box control. We simply answer the questions posed to us by the wizard on each screen and click next until we're done. So once again, a list box can either look up values in a table or query, it can select from values that you've typed in by hand, or it can find a record in a form based on the value selected in the list box so you'd make your choice and click Next. You would then add the fields that you'd like to see. Click Next. In the next screen you can choose the width of the fields and click Next. And finally click and select what label you'd like for the list box. And then click Finish. When we view this in form view, here you can see all of the different employees. And if you click on anyone, down below, you can see that it's then reflecting that particular individual's address information. Like what you see? Pick up your free copy of the complete tutorial at www.teachucomp.com forward slash free.